Welcome to Abadada Computer Corporation's video training program. These short informative videos are produced by Abadada as a service for our customers. If you have questions regarding this video or any other product or service we offer, please contact Abadada at 989-883-3411 or visit our website at www.abadada.com. This video and its contents are subject to Abadada's terms and conditions of sale. Terms and conditions can be found on our website at www.abadada.com. I'm going to demonstrate how to clear the password from Communications Assistant. Now it doesn't matter if it's Communications Assistant Pro or Basic. And by the way, right while we're talking about Basic, uh, you get 128 free licenses of Basic uh, on a Panasonic system. So if you don't have that, you can always just call us and we can set you up with licensing for that. Communications Assistant can be cleared from any telephone. Uh, all we need is the manager's password and we need to dial in uh, just the uh, correct sequence in order to clear the extensions pass or the communications extensions password. So what we're going to do is we'll press program like such and then what we're going to do is hit star one now it's going to ask for a password, and this is going to be the system manager's password. So we'll enter that. And then it's going to display on the screen manager program number. Now what we're going to put in for that is going to be 91, 91, and then press the enter key. Now in this KXNT343 phone, the, in, the enter key is down on the jog dial or the little round dial at the bottom. It'll say enter. And then it'll ask for extension number. We'll enter the extension number of the extension that has communications assistant associated with it that we want to clear. So in this case, we're going to clear 105. So I'll dial in 105. And it says clear, yes or no. We'll say yes. And that's it. Now the screen doesn't change, but I assure you it is cleared. And at this point, you can just lift up the phone, hang it back up and then our display returns to normal. Now for the next piece what we're going to do is we're going to go over to a workstation and show you how to actually log back into Communications Assistant. You're going to find Communications Assistant underneath the start menu usually and we'll pick up with our next little segment of the video. Okay at this point we've reset the password at the extension or from an extension using the manager's password and program 91. At this point, we're going to go to the workstation where Communications Assistant was installed. Now, in front of you here is Communications Assistant running. It may or may not be running. It may be sitting there waiting for a password. Uh, no matter what, at this point, what we're going to do is we're going to close down Communications Assistant. And we're going to restart it. Now, we can restart it by restarting your computer. Communications Assistant is usually found in the startup folder. So we could restart it by restarting the Communications Assistant or the computer itself or just going in to Programs, Startup Folder, and then we, we see Communications Assistant there. And we've started it and we get a message. And what it's saying is that it's had a problem log again. We're not going to worry about that. We're just going to click OK. Now we see our IP address information and our port and all that. That just stays the same. The extension number associated with that stays the same. But you see the password field here. We're just going to take that password and take it out. Now we're going to go down to the bottom. We'll leave automatically log in uh, checked if you want it to automatically log in. That's the easiest and simplest and then just click the login button. Now it's going to start up a window and that window is going to ask you for your new password and you'll put that in here and then verify it. And then click OK. And then it tells us that the password was successfully changed. We click OK. And then Communications Assistant proceeds to log in. And it appears on your screen. That is how to reset the 
password and communications assistant for a particular extension. I hope that this video has been helpful and as always we wish to serve you at Abidata. Thank you. We hope you have enjoyed watching this information video courtesy of Abidata Computer Corporation and that it has been informative and relative to your needs. If you have questions regarding this video or any other product or service we offer, please contact Abadada Computer Corporation at 989-883-3411 or visit us on the web at www.abadada.com or www.panasonic-phone.net. Remember, we are making computerization magically easy.